Skin fades are back in for number one, the low skin Nah, fade. don't put them on the low skin fade like what that, bro. Not, My bro. word. Okay, let me, let me show you. Let me show you. All right, big heads, now that your head is on the whiteboard, the best way to communicate with your barber about your preferred type of fade is how dark you want this specific area right here. The C cup or the arches. Now, I promise you, if you fuck around and say those words to your barber, it might just end up kissing you on the lips. Now, as I was saying earlier, if you like low skin fades, your barber's gonna start the low skin fade right here on the lower part of the C cup and wrap around the head. And for the mid skin fades, your barber's gonna start right there in the middle of the C cup. He's gonna start his bald line right there, keeping half that C cup arch area and fade around the head just like that. Now, if you are in the military though, high is the way to go. Hmm, actually, speaking of which. Yo, can you get you? What the yeah. fuck do you want, bro? Yo, I need your help again. Why are you always fucking asking for help when I'm taking shit, bro? Yes, I will cut your hair after. All right, help you. So now, I'm gonna show you the differences between all three types of skin fades. Yo, roll the B-roll. The low skin fade is keeping those arches nice and dark. Now, off to the mid fade. A mid skin fade, keeping just half of that C cup nice and dark. And so for my preferred type of fade, a high fade, I don't like any C cups here, so Ken's gonna start the fade right there and get rid of it. High fade, stay tuned. There we have it, the high skin fade. Not a single C cup to be found. What do you think, fire or fire? 